hello Tauruses so this is the first half of the month reading for you guys so I'm gonna start it from tomorrow until the 15th so let's start with the general messages the universe we have three cards for any messages you have for Tauruses for May the 2nd to the 15th 2022 universe give me one more card and happy birthday so let's look here so you guys have honesty, um, then you guys have courage, adversity, then there's judgment, perseverance, love, and surrender. Okay. Um, I feel like this is you, you guys make amends with something, okay? Um, this could be somebody that you had to strife with um, for a while. This could be your parent, this could be a friend, this could be a family member, this could even be a, um, an ex-lover. I feel like you guys are making peace with something. Um, you're clearing that energy away um, and you're doing it out of love it's not a of like spite or resentment I feel like you're just clearing that energy away okay so that's good let's look okay let's look at the romance angel and the capper deck Universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Tauruses? Okay, so there is retreat. This could be the one. Let your friends help you. Separation and it's safe for you to love. Jenna energy is deception. Hmm. Next messages. Let's look here. Universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have? Okay. Main female thoughts, bad health, toy and labor, wealthy man, privileged lady. Okay, so what I'm getting here, okay, this is pertaining to this um to the single tourists who is about to give someone a chance to be in a relationship. You are, some of you guys are sensing red flags when it comes to this person. So it's like you guys don't want to be too caught up with them. You probably don't want to um, be in a relationship right away with them right now or in a commitment right now. Okay. Um, you're trying to see this is someone who have another side to them. Um, so right now you're kind of being just, you're being very um, cautious. Basically you're cautious because um, probably this person have been showing you some signs of like, Mm, this person might have another side to them okay that's what i'm getting so even though they have been treating you well like you are picking up on some red flags at the same time okay that's what i'm getting so let's look let's look at the tarot let's see what's, what else i'm getting Okay, so universe, give me a five card spread. What's going to happen in Taurus's love life for May the second to the fifteenth? Universe, universe, give me three more cards. Universe, give me two more cards. What's going to happen to Taurus's love life for May the second to the fifteenth? Universe. Universe, give me one more card. Yeah, see, I feel like they did something. They did something where you re you're reevaluating things. Okay, you're taking a step back. Um, I do see you guys probably still have the chance to make things work. It's just right now, it's like you are not feeling the connection like how you did before. But they do get the four of cups, which is rejection. I feel like before you was more open with the strength in reverse, then something have changed. They probably show you part of themselves that you, now you feel like this person have another side. Then I got the magician in reverse, the resource in reverse. 
wanting to reconcile, wanting to fix things with you. Okay. And then I see the six of cups as the last position. So let's see if you guys are, um, if you guys can work this out. Universe club by six of cups. The hangman reverse and the fool and reverse. You're still going to be apprehensive a little bit. Like you're just going to take a step back. Universe clarify the fool in reverse and the hangman in reverse. Universe clarify the judgment. But you still, okay. The judgment's there. So you guys might still work at this connection. Might still work on it. Okay, universe clarify the swords and the magician in reverse. Universe, Cup by Three Swords and Magician in reverse. Ace of Cups in reverse. And a Page of Cups in reverse. Okay. Yeah, they did something to turn you off. <laughs> okay. But I do see them trying to fix whatever they did. Okay. Universe, Cup by Four of Cups. Eight of Wands. Yeah, they're trying to communicate with you. They, I, I feel like this is someone who don't realize <laughs> what they did. Okay, universe cup by seven of cups. Yeah, I don't realize that. And I feel like once you guys have this talk with them, they are going to be more mindful. Universe clarify the strength in reverse. The king of wands, seven of swords. Okay, yeah, they did something kind of shady or shy. See, universe clarify by king of swords. Universe clarify by king of swords. Two of swords. Ace of Swords in reverse, Page of Wands, yeah, you're becoming detached. So what I'm getting is that if it's resting, I still see you guys are still going to date each other, still trying to connect, but at the same time, you're just going to be not as open as you probably was before. Um, if you're thinking about opening up, I feel like you're still not going to be opening up completely because you may feel like this is someone who you can't fully trust. So I do see them, whatever they did that make you feel like you can't fully trust them, they was not aware of it. I, so I feel like once they have the, once you guys have the conversation, they're gonna be more aware of themselves and more mindful. Okay, um, that's what I'm getting. There's still a possibility of you guys working, um, to, working it out together if you wanted to. Okay, um, this person sign. This person could be a Leo, a Cancer, a Scorpio, an Aries, a Gemini. Okay, yeah, that's the signs I'm getting. So I guess look at the other deck. Okay, let's look here. Alright, universe, give me a four card spread. I'm not suggesting you have four choices for May the 2nd to the 15th. So there's still emotion, there's recognition reward, there is emotional um, loss, victory success, nine of swords, Jenna energy is suffering silence, okay? Yeah, so I feel like with you, you kind of let it be known of like what you saw in them um, that they was not mindful of. And I feel like they regret like not being you know, just being authentic and genuine with you. Um, cause I feel like they probably did something shady or shy where you kind of look at them in a different light. Like you can't fully trust them. I feel like they want to work it out. I feel like now they like, like, damn, I didn't realize it impacted you like that. So I do see them being more aware and mindful. Okay, so uniform, give me a fourth card spread. I'm not suggesting you have four Tauruses. So there is priest, there's trickster, there is rebel, and Don Juan. Yeah, so you, you guys feel like you can't trust them. Okay, they appear one way, but you saw another side to them. It's like, ah, uh, you can't really trust them. So a lot of you guys are just probably going to, if you are single, but you was thinking about, you know, choosing them to commit to. I feel like you guys are just going to keep your options open. So let's look here. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread. I'm not suggesting you have four Tauruses. 
for May the 2nd to the 15th. Get more information. Yeah. So right now you, you really trying to read them. Okay. In the near future, no, remain positive and yes. <laughs> Okay, big happy changes. Yeah, I see that they are going to correct their behavior. They're going to do that. So with that Six of Cups being the last position in the, the tarot spread, I see you guys still might um, give each other, like you guys might work it out together. Okay. So let's look here. Universe, give me a two card spread. Well, let's just see how for Taurus So, the unknown and soul's journey and listening to my body. Okay. So, my health is my life, the temple, my experience, and the grace, my blessings. And then there's unknown. I bow to the infinite intelligence of the cosmos, and my next steps are revealed. And then there's soul's journey. Living from the soul opens me to the magic that exists when I surrender to divine manifestation on its own terms and timing. So yeah, I feel like with the unknown and the soul journey, that's just you listening to your intuition as well with this card too. I'm trying to see who's best for you. Um, you're not trying to settle. Um, you're not trying to settle. You're not trying to settle down with the wrong person. None of them. Okay. Um, some of you guys can sense there is some things that you can't fully trust when it comes to them. So you're just taking a step back. Okay, so that's the reading that I have for you, Tauruses. Happy birthday, and thank you guys for watching my videos and, and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a person with me at queenfortheterrell at gmail.com.